All right, today we are using an EverTough radiator and cap test kit, number 67085, and the adapter set, radiator cap and adapter set 67086. This is for my BMW 330i, and we're losing fluid. So let's find out what's the problem. Inside the kit, we have several different adapters and a pump. And in this kit, we have some screw-on adapters. So depending on what your car uses, you'll hopefully have the right adapter in the kit. Now, this is something that you can rent from AutoZone or purchase. First, you're gonna make sure that your car is cool. You're going to take off the radiator cap. We're going to see what fits it. We have different styles here. This one is a clip-on, but we have threads here. This one again, it uses a clip. This is a clip-to-clip -clip adapter. Let's look at these. It's a clip and an outside thread. This one here is this clip, but look at this, inside threads, and this is going to fit right here. There's an O-ring and threads. So nice and snug. All right, we're gonna just put it on just like radiator cap. Line these tabs up with these slots. Now this right here is a pressure release. You twist it. If you twist it while it's on, it's gonna lift up the valve and loosens it, but if you do it, now it's snug. So you'll know if it's gonna build pressure or not. So at this point, let's pump. We are 7 PSI. Do we see anything? Let's check it out. We're gonna inspect. Well, this was fast. Look at that. Right here, top. Oh, look at that. There's that. Looks like it's definitely been there before. look around and see if there's anything else but that's looks like the junction from the box to the radiator itself see fluid down here but I think due to gravity that's gonna come from up here Let's do some research and see uh, what our problem is. It's probably just a seal right in there. All right, so it's been a couple of minutes. You can see the pressure has receded. It's down about like six and a half PSI now. And uh, since we saw that leak, I think I'm gonna release the pressure and do some research. See, it's loose. It's back to zero, so we can twist it right off, take it all apart, and look for some parts. Silly BMW. All right, looks like I'm replacing this reservoir. Anyway, I hope you like this video. Please share, like, subscribe. Good luck with your own. Bye-bye.